let's revisit how Fernando Tatis Jr. is able to take impressive hell hacks while under control with 100% controlled aggression. This breakdown was requested by Josh Cathcart from Hitting Done Right. Have you ever watched a hitter swing a bat and think, this isn't normal? That's Tatis Jr. According to one study, he is able to consistently reach an estimated 700 degrees per second hip rotation in his swing. Most of the readings were documented while swinging during live at-bats with count leverage. The baseball-specific movement in the swing is called kinematic sequence. Sports science research says his power starts from the ground up. Hips fire first, then the torso, then the hands. This is how Fernando is able to generate superior bat speed, exit velocity, and compound the distance of balls even on pitches he is out in front of. The hip-torso separation, this is the X factor. Tatis isn't just swinging for the fences, he's seemingly a biomechanics masterpiece. Tatis didn't just wake up with this, it's biomechanics you can work on as well. And here's the thing, it's not magic, it's teachable. If a good swing starts from the ground up, and it does, then understanding the kinetic chain from the legs, the center of gravity to the upper half, is a blueprint you can master. Whose swing would you like us to talk about next? Let us know in the comments, and if you want to learn more about swing mechanics and approaches in general, then follow us.